Welcome back to the channel, everybody. It's Sippin' and Rippin' again, and we're gonna get you something newer. Um, kind of the same old taps update um, on this channel. It's only been a blaster, and then whatever came in the Kotzko flagship packs is what I've opened for a tops update. But this is the retail box. Not too many of these boxes on YouTube that have been opened, but I've seen some people throw have some pretty good stuff out of the out of these um not expecting too much but uh let's just get right into it we'll get through all the base i saw that all the hits come at the end of the pack so i'll just skip through the base and save you the time because no one wants to see another gunner henderson rookie debut or corbin carroll rookie debut maybe the first time this came out that's all cool and stuff but Let's just get all these out. Come on. There we go. Oh, bam. Look at those. We'll close this back up. Um, it's 20 packs, 14 cards a pack. Uh, autograph and relic cards. Um, Royal Blue Base Card Parallels. That's just the retail blue. And then Golden Mirror Base Parallel Cards. I'd be surprised if we got one of those. Um, with my luck recently, um, it's been, it's been good. Um, Hidden Gems, Jordan Walker that I pulled from Tops Update in a Costco, and then these in the Chrome Update out of two blasters back to back in the, um, one of the videos. I don't know when I'm going to upload this one, um, if it's going to be right after that video or if I'm going to put in some Costco, um. Casco flagship collection exclusive ones. Um, we'll see, but the Anthony Volpe auto, rookie auto out of 99. <laughs> Big pull there, gonna send that into PSA. Um, get it graded and see what we can get. That's, I'm thinking a 10, the Logan Webb not so much. I think that's gonna be like a nine or an eight. It's got some dings on it, so yeah. Um, beer of the day is Black Bavarian again. I uh, have a couple more of these to drink up, so cheers, everybody. Good old Sprecker. <laughs> so let's just let that settle. Not the best pour, but hey. It's beer. It's going to go down no matter what. So let's get into at least the first pack. I'll still cheers. Get through all that uh, foam, aka head. Didn't want to just leave it at head because you sickos out there would have been like, oh, I gotta get through all that head first, huh? Let's keep it PG, let's keep it PG. Alright. So, whip de woo. We'll go through all that later. There's that Trout Rodriguez card. And. So, just went a dud pack. We'll go right side first. <laughs> so we're hoping for some color out of here. Hoping for a sweet, like, rookie gold. That'd be pretty cool. Of course, image variations, SPs, all that good stuff. That'd be pretty fun. Um, get that Nolan Ryan and Aaron Nola. It's not Masataki Oshida at the end there. Was that a anything? I'm sorry. No, it's just his regular rookie debut, I believe. I don't know if these cards will come upside down, all of them. If it's like image variation or like a parallel. We'll see. Um, here's one of those thingamabobs at the end. Uh, let's see if these have fire in them. If so, feel for those in the retail boxes. It looks like they might have retail blue in it, so it's better than the other ones we've opened already. And Devin Williams, he pulled his chrome of this aqua in the chrome update out of the hobby box. So there's another one for the for the 
PC, George Kirby on the All-Star, and Carlos Rodon. So nothing too crazy in there. You're going to get a parallel and two inserts in an All-Star game, so better than the first two packs. I maybe feel for those, and then only buy those. We'll see, though. So again, not really expecting too much out of this. Um, but just fun, nonetheless, that we can open up something new and see what comes out of it. <laughs> oh boy, and as I say that, there's a card that's probably worth the box. Now, I haven't been really into looking up home field advantages. Um, I've never pulled one and I've always wanted to pull one because it's like they're downtown, but easier to pull for tops than it is for Panini downtowns. They're very hard case hits. <laughs> but if you want one, you probably want Volpe or Carol, Gunnar Henderson, Adley Rushman. If they have those, I don't even know. I'm just pulling Volpe's. What is going on? Is it a sign that I should just collect Volpe? It's not a bad one to collect, but... What is going on right now? All right. Well, the box is already worth it. Go out and get one. Um, the guys that I was watching, they all had pretty, pretty good pulls, pretty good color, just not the right people, but they also had like... A home field advantage one. I think it was Hunter Green, and then some decent rookies like Rainbows, bl Retail Blues, and like some color. There's only one that I like watching consistently. His name's Ogre Breaks. He didn't really have the best, but he had some good Retail Blue rookies in it, so he was content with it. I'd be content with you know some good Retail Blue rookies. Here's one of those tags at the end. Let's see what comes in that. Um, but I'm already happy and content. I can pull no one else. And that'd be just fine. Because that's my first home field advantage. And I like it. Ever. <clears throat> I don't even own a home field advantage. So it seems like these tags have a lot of inserts and all-star game stuff in them. John Smoltz. Rookie card of a Singa. So let's just do... That. We're going to see how much we get for parallels, and then also, so right now I'd say two. We got the retail blue and then the home field advantage. Let's see what else we can get. There's Garrett Mitchell. High hopes on him. Grayson Rodriguez. Gunner. And we got something. We got a Hunter Brown rookie card. Got the Gunner, and let's just flip it. We got a Rami Gonzalez on the rainbow, so we'll put that there. So two parallels and the home field advantage. Let's keep going. Oh, need to sip on some beers for you after that one. I took about three. I'll do two or three for the Volpe, and then the PC was like a half one. Michael's Bush, let's go. You got another retail blue here. Oh, George Soriano. I don't think I have too many of his cards. Um, another Miami pitcher. Yuri Perez, Edward Cabrera, and Jordan Walker. A lot of upcoming rookie pitchers then, I guess, for Miami. Don't mind Miami as a team. Miami Marlins. All right, Joey Ortiz, let's just go to the back. We got something here. I think another all-star game, James Oatman. All-star game, Ronald Acuna. 35 of Bryce Miller. Pretty cool card. And what do we got here? We've got... Ah! This is the Golden Mirror. Don't know much about Sam Haggerty. It is the no. It's um never mind. It's the vintage stock. 
of Sam Haggerty. It wasn't the Golden Mirror. First, I thought it was. But that's pretty cool. You get a vintage stock, not of the person that you want, but hey. Is that in, what, 99? Yep, 99. Let's put that there. Eh, we'll put him on a stage. Sam Haggerty, first time ever getting a stage, I think, from people ripping packs on YouTube. Unless he had a rookie card that was just insane awesome. Sam Haggerty, everybody. I like Flagship. It's always fun to open up. Um, I know a lot of people prefer Flagship over Chrome. Nothing wrong with that. Oh, hoo, hoo. man, are we just pulling some stuff here? I don't think I have Adley Rushman's top gold. I know I have Gunnar Henderson's, but that wasn't one of these tag things, so. All right, cheers on the vintage stock at Adley Rushman. I need to fill this thing up with the rest of it. All right, let's just put, put Adley up there. So yeah, thanks for tuning in, everybody. Hopefully you liked the video so far, and hit that like, subscribe, and comment, whatever you want to do. Much appreciated. All right, so we're done with half the box. And that's what we already got. So we got a vintage stock, Adley Rushman top school, which I think is a decent parallel if you hit a rookie, so I'll count that as one. Home run advantage of Volpe, two retail blues, and a rainbow. Crazy. Uh, price point on this, you don't want to know what I paid for it. It was very low. But usually these run for like 70. Um, so, yeah, much lower than I paid than 70. There is a Monasterio. Played decent for the uh, for the Brew Crew. And we got a top scrum of Justin Verlander. Masataka Yoshida. JD Martinez on the All-Star Game. And Randy Travis. You goof, he's a country singer. Another one of those lovely tags on the back here. So we're probably going to get an all-star game. Every tag had an all-star game in it. So let's see what we got. I don't know why I'm doing this. Let's keep going. Nope. This one didn't. But it did have a cool insert. So they all have like pretty decent inserts in it. We'll put that there. I think every pack has a Stars of the MLB, so if you want to collect the Stars of the MLB set for tops, just get, just get this, you get 20 of them. What is that? There's 30 in each series. So you get 20 right here, and they're all probably different. Let's go. Johnny Brito. Man, do I have a lot of you. <clears throat> Pretty uh, we'll see left or right there, but hey, another rainbow foil. And then Julio Urias, what is he in trouble for? Battery, domestic abuse or something? I uh, haven't really cared too much to follow that. Hopefully, whatever's going on gets solved, and whoever's guilty is guilty, and blah blah blah. And if Urias is guilty. Hopefully never plays in MLB ever again. <clears throat> Same with Wander Franco. Alright. Let's just go crazy here. Let's just stop it with all those discussing talks. Dylan Cease, you did me dirty this year for being my pitcher. Randy, you were supposed to go crazy like you did the year before, but you didn't. All right, this is numbered out of seven. Wow, we got some color. Whoo, this, this, I mean, just don't even open up blasters. Just get this for $60, $70 or whatever it is for. Huh! Cassianos and Jonathan India, look at that. 
wasn't expecting that, but hey, that is cool. I like Jonathan India. Don't like Cassianos too much. I mean, he's a good, good player, good, good batter. But I do like Jonathan India. So that is a cool card. I might just keep it just for a PC because, hey, why not? Not the purple that we've been looking for. That's what people have been saying about these two. It's like you don't get the, get the color you want or get the parallels of rookie rookie players. Can we talk? Uh, you just get some bland, bland cards. Nothing against Sam Haggerty. Um, but it's not what you're looking for. You're looking for rookies, and you're looking, looking for the big rookies. That looks so different. <laughs> that just looks like it should be a, uh, should be a short print. Because it's so clean. 45. Yep. Like this one, Nolan Ryan. Yeah, it's, he's a, Ever, but this just looks it looks more special be a short print 35 even though they don't don't have those all right everybody we have five five left let's keep going gosh i'm skipping through all the base and i'm already at 16 minutes yikes all right i need to figure out how to get these to be down Brett Beatty on the chrome. That's a good one. Hunter Green. Let's keep going. All right. I'm already calling it a win a long time ago when we opened up that Anthony Volpe. It's just he's my guy. I'm just pulling all the Anthony Volpe's. And I just need to pull the one of one now, everybody. Give me that one of one Anthony Volpe, and then I'll just read. Tell you, is this a black or is this another Topps Gold? I don't know what this is. Topps Gold? No. <laughs> what? All right, we're going to save this. Do I need to get out Rusty? <laughs> I don't know what that is. I really don't. Black, what is that out of? Red's out of 5, Black's out of 25, 10, who knows, but we're going to see in a little bit, what is this box, why do you even open up a hobby box, I mean, I understand why, there's, look at the, look at, look, look at Volpe, he's just everywhere, he's going to be in my dreams tonight, which is kind of weird, Michael's, Michael's Bush, didn't even know he had a Stars of the MLB, Oh, cool. Maybe maybe he is, like, secretly awesome. I'm just going to put Volpe as center stage right here. All the Volpe cards. All right. Another one of those tags. It's going to have something good. It's going to be the one of one Chrome update patch. Just randomly placed in flagship right here. Carlos Rodon. He's haunting me, everybody. Literally. He's like, screw you. I screwed your f f baseball season. Show hey. Damn, that's cool. <laughs> I'll take that. Dansby Swanson. So these things are loaded. Like, I'm sorry, I could open up like three blasters and not even get any of this stuff. Three blasters is what? 75? We I mean, didn't even go through all the like the base too, so we probably got every base player. And look at that, another backwards card. Looks like it's not a um, player though, it's like a team or card or something. Selby Perez, Miguel Vargas. And wow, oh it is. Ooh, rainbow foil of Bryce. Miller. Not bad center. I'm just not going to get a 10, but hey, I'm pulling a lot of Bryce lately. Brett and Doyle. <laughs> All right, I'm going to go get Rusty here. Rusty.
Dusty, your good luck. So before, cheers on those poles. Now is this backwards? What's behind this black, whatever card this is? Oh, it's already got whitening on the top. No! So, Jose. All right, it looks like it's a 35th for the Nationals. <laughs> it's Mackenzie Gore Otto. What is going on? I just need to go buy like every store out because I just keep pulling autos. I just keep pulling fire and it's out of 199. Is this card worth a lot of money? Probably not. Not unless it's a parallel auto of an up and coming pitcher out of a retail value box that goes for like 60 70 dollars that i got for 30. all right rusty you did well cheers on that cheers everybody oh i got another beer so so let's see what you can pull out of this. Let's get the Volpe Auto out of the way. You get some Topps Chrome. You get some of these parallels that are just parallels. You get a whole stack of base. You probably complete two thirds of the set because I didn't, I mean, we didn't really go through them all, but I guarantee that they're not all repeats. So let's see. We got one parallel, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight parallels, three numbered cards for parallels, and then you get the 35th numbered card auto, home field advantage, and tops gold, Adley Rushman. Oh, goodness gracious. These are stacked. All right. I mean, I need to do more of these if I can find more. Um, for that price, I'll buy these for 60 bucks if they're loaded like this, 70, 80. I'd go, yeah, I'd go up to 100 if they have an auto and a home field advantage in every pack or in every box. I need to find more of these. Um, but yeah, hit that like, subscribe. I just keep pulling autos and great cards. I, I don't know what else to say. So uh, cheers, everybody. Well, let's open up this beer and one we pour it in. Cheers. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for being a part of the card commu uh, community. Wow, that's a different beer from that one. Um, yeah, I just like talking cards, so um, not trying to get big or anything. Just comment stuff about cards or players or who you're collecting. That'd be great. Uh, I'll comment back. And yeah. All right, see you next time.